Hey guys, what's up? The iPod Kid here, and today I have an iPhone 4 case review from DatchaWorks. Okay, so here's the casing actually on my iPhone. Uh, as you see, it's a pretty nice case. It doesn't really take up too much room and it doesn't add too much bulk aside from these two bumps in the back, but uh, that's kind of a selling point because like they do say, it does fit and feel very, very natural in your hands. Uh, so if you're going to be doing a lot of camera footage and or filming, then it's going to be a definite strong suit for you. Uh, the top and bottom of your device will be completely exposed. The volume switches on the side, uh, those are going to be exposed as well, and then you have the full front interface. And it's a pretty nice, very, very light lightweight and really not too noticeable casing. Uh, the back, like I said, does have the two bumps, which is going to be for the uh, photography and filming. You have a bumpy bottom and then also a uh, smooth top, and that's pretty much all the strong points of this case. Uh, the only thing that I have had some problems with is it's kind of difficult to apply onto your device, but it is nearly impossible to get this casing off. Uh, it took me about 10-15 minutes to get the case off the first time that I applied it on so that's definitely kind of a uh, downside if you feel that you're going to be switching cases out sometimes but uh, yeah other than that it's a really really good case it's pretty cheap too it only comes in black which is kind of a downside it does fit both AT&T and Verizon models of the iPhone 4 and uh, hopefully you guys want to go check it out if so I do have the link in the more info section down below and hopefully you guys enjoyed this video I'll talk to you later have a fantastic day